Now y'all like, damn, all she do is have Starbucks and go get massages. Yes, yes, self-care. I just want to say that growth is not letting... <laughs> growth is not... What? Growth is not linear. Y'all, thank you, not sweet potato marshmallow. What? Because I knew better than to work out and they ain't been eating. Don't y'all say nothing about that damn quick trip cup in the back. Okay. Because <laughs> I didn't even remember. I don't, when I get in the car, I'm not looking back there. I didn't even remember it was back there till I'm looking at my viewfinder. And if I move all this stuff out of the way, yeah, yeah, you can definitely see it. <laughs> anyway, y'all, what's up? Welcome back. So, today is the first day that I've been to the gym. I cannot believe this because I don't even know the last time this has happened. Literally, y'all, it is Monday. Thursday would make three weeks so I'm what three days shy of it literally being three weeks since I've been in somebody's gym that is so crazy to me and I knew better because I didn't even so the last time I was at the gym y'all know like I tracked my weight I knew better than to even try to do the weight I was doing three weeks ago so I did it but I still did you know like for instance on the uh hack squat um well the reverse hack squat right um, I usually do eight 45 pound plates and this time I only did six so I'm missing about 90 pounds I feel like that's a significant amount it's almost 100 pounds but it was still quite an on there if it was 645 you know what I'm saying right baby I almost fell out in the gym twice even the leg press like the leg press you're you're mostly like sitting there you're not even standing up and when i was done with the set and i would get off to like you know switch the camera or whatever because i did some recording on my phone and then with y'all baby like it seems like the whole room is spinning like i'm like whoa like like and it doesn't feel good i'm over here holding my head like girl please do not pass out in the gym but i knew better i knew better and what's crazy is i actually for like yesterday what did i eat I ate two oxtails finishing up the food in the morning and like a, two tablespoons of macaroni and cheese like very little but still you know and then last night I even forced myself to eat um I made a that one the brisket I bought I made a little sandwich again not a lot of food y'all probably was not a thousand calories but it's something and it's better than like what I was doing because I wasn't having nothing but a smoothie or nothing at all so I, you know, I'm like, no, because I know I'm going to the gym. Let me try to eat and no. So anyway, but I went, um, I feel good. Besides, I feel a little, I still feel a little, uh, um, I sweated really good because of the oxy shred, cold snow tin, what's up? Um, <laughs> I just can't wait to like everything's flowing again. I mean, I guess like it's getting better. Um, Y'all seen me weigh in at 225, which I put some of my weight back on because the last time I weighed myself, which was like, I want to say like mm, four or five days ago, I was at 222, but that's when I wasn't eating anything. And now that I've started eating, like I told y'all, I probably was going to come back. If I can just not let it get back to 230, 
that would be great because I told y'all it was water and probably muscle or whatever um, because I didn't look any better even though the weight was going down on the scale we talked about that uh, but I just want to get back in the groove start walking again and get my steps in and working out eating uh, eating right with that being said I do have a lunch date with Tiff uh to go get tacos nobody's appetite at all y'all so i might get like two tacos uh this was more so just a day for us to like catch up but we always go eat i need to eat but appetite is not existing i don't i don't know i don't know so that's what we're gonna do today i have no idea i need to edit some content that i shot today because i ain't been posting i need to figure out what i'm gonna do with my rompers i was gonna get a studio y'all know i go get my rent at my studio but i kind of think i want to do an outside thing and i don't know if i'm gonna do it today or tomorrow i'm probably gonna do it tomorrow but yeah my nails need to be done so my feet need to be done too but child maybe we'll do that today i just really don't know i'm still in a loop of like well what do i do i have orders i could pack there's stuff to do but it's like what do I do and I'm not like in a groove yet but we get in there though we get in there I'm not mad okay y'all quick little outfit of the day um we have this like racer back ribbed tank top from Target I really want to go and get a lot of loungewear from Target because Target loungewear and like athleisure I don't really care too much for like their active wear in terms of working out I feel like it's more athleisure vibes but they got some really cute stuff I haven't even worn this before I actually have one in like a tan color and I have worn that one but not this one then we have the Hilera jegging flare on deck y'all know I love these it's actually my first time wearing them but um they came through real clutch I got so many Hilara pants now like love that for me i just need to wear them and then just some uh my michael kors slides my feet need to be done they don't even need to be out ready for colder weather <laughs> and then uh my little coach bucket purse and we are going to get tacos <laughs> Y'all, thank you, not sweet potato marshmallow. What? Oh my God, it's so like, mm. Roasted sweet potatoes with nutmeg, cinnamon, and marshmallow sweet cream. That is good. And that's what I was thinking. They got coffee flavor. This is my favorite. This is so I want to try the uh, lemon bar. What is so if it's dairy free? It's basically it's just made with coconut cream instead of regular milk. I like it though. Like it just seems like the lemon bar like has coconut cream. If you like that one, I also suggest you try our buttermilk frozen yogurt. I feel like it's You said try what? Try the buttermilk frozen yogurt. Oh my god. I just said I ain't want no ice cream. Oh my God, that sweet potato. She back, she back. <laughs> I'm finna get a cone. I'm gonna get it probably a, a pint and a cone. Didn't eat no tacos, had one taco, but now I'm eating ice cream. It's like sweet It reminds me of the wild berry lavender, it's good. Y'all, it is hot as shit out here. Fall need to go on ahead and fall, baby. The sweet potato, sweet potato, sweet potato, cream, marshmallow, whatever. Mm -mm. This is so good. <laughs> I got the lemon in a pint to take it home. The lemon. And then they let me buy some um, waffle bowls for my lemon ice cream. I got the lemon dairy bar. That shit tastes just like a lemon bar. It is so good. It's a good day. I don't know the last time I had an ice cream cone on a hot day. Or had an ice cream cone in general. Like, just little simple stuff really do be pleasurable. I should get myself ice cream more often. <laughs> hey, y'all. I ended up going to get my nails done. I just got the cutest like green color for fall. 
even though it's hot as hell look at this y'all can't say this is just not a very very pretty color like do you see this anyway nothing much um yeah when i got my nails done it is like nine o'clock so that's pretty much it for me today um i'm going to eat the rest of those tacos that i didn't eat i knew i wasn't going to eat i don't know that like, i thought that working out would help me get my appetite back but alas it did not um girl i don't know so i ordered two tacos and i don't know why i guess because they were like birria they ended up being like when you order one it was basically like an order of one was two so i basically got four tacos and i only ate one so i have three and then i did have the ice cream cone so i mean you know a little bit but Coming from somebody that was eating three meals a day, and even before that too, but it was like good meals. Like I always ate breakfast, even if it wasn't until like 12 or 1. I had my eggs, my hash browns, you know, whatever. And then I would eat a good dinner. And now, <laughs> and I was even telling Tip like, girl, like y'all seen the scale this morning, like lost weight, but don't look like I lost weight because it wasn't good weight. It was water and probably muscle i don't look any better how i should be looking at the way that i met but that's neither here nor there i can't really do much i bought that damn i went to um y'all didn't even know this i went to sprouts when my mom was here and bought that damn tuna the deal tuna that i really like and i need to eat that before i go bad but i haven't ate none and then i bought that remember the um the truffle mushroom steak i cooked it because i wanted my mom to taste it and that's in the fridge ain't like that just food in the fridge that i don't need to go bad because i don't need to be wasting money especially with some food i actually like like good food that i like and that i want that i need but anyway um i'll see y'all tomorrow i'm going to therapy tomorrow I'm going to the gym again of course um i have some stuff from amazon that should be here that we got to put together so that would be cool and i need to do the pictures for um the jumpsuit that i haven't showed y'all i keep forgetting i keep talking about it the new romper i showed it on live but y'all will see it tomorrow so see y'all tomorrow Mm -hmm. I'm leaving therapy I was just as y'all heard it was stormy real bad and so um I was trying to wait for the hard ass rain to subside before I jumped on this expressway because I am in Marietta which is a little minutes away from where I actually live and yeah, I don't really trust Atlanta drivers like that when the, the weather, oh, there was some lightning. When the weather not doing what it's supposed to do, but it, it's still very much raining. It's just a little lighter, but it's thundering and it's storming, which is crazy because when I left the house, and the, the sun is trying to peek back out. I don't know. When I left the house, it was nice. And like I started coming up north because Marietta is north from where I stay and it just the weather was bad so i don't know what it's like like actually where i live but i was supposed to um do my photos for the romper that y'all still have not seen but to be honest with y'all do i really feel like doing it of course not no i did go to the gym this morning and that's about all i did because i just start feeling you know so then I was like, all right, well, I'm just going to lay here until it's time for uh, therapy. Still not eating that much and not sleeping that much. Like, I sleep, but I toss and turn. With that being said, I'm right in front of a Chick-fil-A. And I was so excited when Chick-fil-A announced that they was dropping, like, you know, the honey pimento chicken sandwich. Like, I was so excited about it. And I haven't had it. And the way my appetite is set up I probably wouldn't even be tell you if it's good or not Cause it's like Food ain't really You know how I eat Y'all know I'm real passionate about my food And so like when I eat I be like oh I don't know like it's just eh, Like it, food ain't even really tasting good So I haven't had it Cause I really wanna Have a chance to taste it Get into it And I don't know how long they're gonna have it But hopefully this is a sign Again I went to the gym today 
thinking that, you know, me working out, my appetite will come back. I'm not strong as I was three weeks ago. I'm tell y'all that. Like, the weight ain't. Mm -mm. And I just probably know because I just don't have the strength from not eating. But I'm actually hungry today. Well, I haven't eaten and it's 4 o'clock. I guess you would be. I feel, I, I, I feel like I want to eat. <laughs> not like... And I don't even have a taste for nothing. So, again, like the appetite. But my stomach is like, you know, I, I should eat. So, I don't know. I'm going to go home and eat something. And uh, I don't think... Because I don't know what the weather looks like on my side of town. I may just wait and hold off and do those pictures tomorrow. Since tomorrow is my gym rest day. And just forget it. What's another damn thing? Um... But I do have that Amazon stuff. I think I told y'all about it. I need to set up. It did come and I want to show y'all and like set it up. I'm doing some things to my room. I need to get like all new bedding. I said that and I wanted to get some orange sheets for the fall since y'all know my comforter is black. And like really have like some Halloween shit going on. But I'm just going to get home and unbox what I do have. And we'll see what the weather looks like when I reach my side of town. But I do need to eat. And I actually did think about getting the chicken sandwich. But like I said, I probably wouldn't enjoy it. Probably a lot going on with the pimento cheese, the jalapenos, and the honey. Like, you got a lot going on. Um, and I have food in the refrigerator that really needs to be eaten before it can't be eaten. It's expired. So there's that. But, yeah. <sighs> Little transparency moment with y'all. I just want to say... That growth is not letting <laughs> growth is lot what growth is not linear. Um, as much as I y'all know the last vlog, we're not gonna have no more sad vlogs. And as happy as I was yesterday, like yesterday, I was in a good mood. I don't even know why, but I went out. I kind of chilled, didn't do much. Um, but I was in a good mood. Got the ice cream. Like I was in a good mood yesterday. I was in a great mood. I'm saying that growth or basically not growth, healing isn't linear because y'all today, like I said, yesterday was great. Nothing has happened today that would have been a trigger or anything. I woke up, I was okay, went to the gym. And when I was at the gym, like when I walked in the gym, I just felt like a wave of sadness, like nothing just, and I was like, nope. If that, we about to work out, come on. I managed to get through the workout, but then when I got home, I told y'all like, stinky, sweaty, wet gym clothes just laid in the bed and put the heated blanket over me. And then I listened to this sermon that my mama sent me and then it was time to go to therapy. So then when I got to therapy, I cried on the way to therapy. Got to therapy, um, I cried in therapy. I knew I was, but like, you know, we got to talking and I started crying. I came back. I felt okay. I told y'all I was going to eat and I ate. I watched Hannibal crying. I cried. Y'all, I got home at like four something. It is 6.51, 7 o'clock. I, I don't know. Like, and I could see if something happened that triggered me. But no, just crying, like can't breathe crying. But I say all that to, to say I'm very proud of myself for my growth because instead of me just laying in the bed for the rest of the day and say to hell with the day, you know, I'm sad, whatever. I took time for myself and I gave myself grace and I rested there and I let myself cry and I didn't feel bad about it. And I sat there and then I said okay all right let's go get the stuff downstairs from Amazon so that we can I can show y'all what I got we can put it together and I'm a vlog which the old me would have just been like to hell with that I'm done for the day but I just took the time that I needed and then I moved on so that felt really good um and I feel better now it's so weird but yeah it's not it's not a linear thing. Like, I was so good yesterday, wasn't good today. I might be good tomorrow. Hell, I might be good the next week, like seven short days. Just, oh my God, yes. And then three days after that, there were three days of just, I don't know. But I'm really just taking it like minute by minute, hour by hour. 
not even day by day, but like, what do I need? My therapist said something great. She always says good things, but she said something today like, what is the the inner child in you need right now? Just she said, when you are feeling sad or whatever's going on, I just want you to think about, okay, what do I need right now in this minute to take care of myself? So again, when I got back home, what I needed right now in this minute was to sit there and cry. And I did, and we're moving on. We're moving on. All right, y'all, opening up this huge Amazon box, but don't get too excited, it ain't much in there. Oh, I didn't even need the scissors, this I came open. Um, this thing was heavy. I've never gotten an Amazon box that's actually heavy, but it even has a red sticker like on here that says heavy. <laughs> it was. And I, I can see why it's heavy because when I was going down there, I was like, because I know what I ordered, right? And I'm just like, damn, okay, this can't be. Something told me probably to drive and take my car so I could put the box in the car, but it was fine. Um, but I was just like, from what I ordered, like I know this can't be nothing that I could just grab. And I was right. It was heavy, but I did it. Big snow, strong, strength. I was very strong. I helped my neighbor move a 70 inch TV yesterday. Um, she's a woman and she's very skinny and like little and she was like it's just too much and I was like is it really heavy and I was like it might be heavy to you but you know I'll work out but I was glad I could be of some use to somebody cause child and yeah anyway okay what else did I get I'm... oh okay <laughs> alright y'all so I bought a floor lamp with shelves to basically replace those little mini tables uh, by my bed that y'all know like my hookah and stuff be on. It's really dark in my room. Um, like the lighting that came with the apartment. Y'all remember when I bought those bulbs like with my brother? The light that came with the apartment ain't the best light. Y'all know I have my neon sign but it's green. Well these floor lamps come with the whiz bulbs that change colors. I just thought it would be like a nice little cool ambience and then I have the shelving um to put stuff on so i got it from amazon i will link them but we're gonna put those together baby lord i hope it ain't a lot child and then this is nothing exciting but i got a box of hangers because somehow some way i guess with all these holara hauls um what was i about to say <laughs> i don't have any hangers like i have clothes in my room that my mom folded for me and there was nothing i could do because there was no hangers and I tried to clean my closet out, but it wasn't nowhere for the clothes to go. So I was like, all right, let me order hangers. So those are 60, uh, a 60 piece of hanger. But um, I really just want to put those shelves together and show y'all and Young is over here like, girl, are you going to feed me or no? <laughs> you was in your room crying and eating. I ain't ate today. You know, without me, I get it. Uh, this is something small. It is a, a tripod. That I didn't need, but you know, whatever. It's um a suction cup tripod so that I could just get more angles, different angles, better angles. Um yeah, I think I'm just gonna open these floor mats out here. Cause y'all, I need to uh clean my room, but again, how did the TV come on? I really couldn't because I didn't have hangers. To put all the clothes up and then I want to change my sheets because them sheets been cried on for weeks girl they got food all in them <sighs> I just wanted to then I want to vacuum my floor all that but we're gonna just hey put the lights up right now because it's seven um I really want to call it a night y'all I did but I was like nope you had your cry now let's get on so I'm gonna open this I'm gonna feed you Blockhead. Come here, young. Come here. Would you like a love and attention? Look, yes, of course so. Come here. Get up. Come here. Young, why'd you pee in the floor? Come here. I'm not mad at you. Come here. Stop. Get up. Do y'all see this? Like he's laying there peeing. Come here. Why are you afraid? Come here. Wow. You really over here like I be beating you and I don't. Come here. Come here, y'all. Come here. Why are you afraid? Come here. Come here. Y'all, this is crazy. Come here. Where you at? Come here. He is peeing. Come here. 
All right, I'm gonna leave you alone. Cause now it's pee everywhere. Okay, go get in your bed. Go. Go. That was y'all. Do y'all see this? Pee. Like. Cause y'all be asking me where did he be? This is literally why y'all don't see him. Cause I don't really interact with him. Because that's why. All right, y'all. So this is what it looks like out the box. Doesn't look too difficult. You literally have these. Oh, I spoke too soon. Damn it. I have these metal rods. Oh, but this is what's, y'all. Oh my God. Not in the mood for this. Here's the bulb I was telling y'all about, though. Like the, um, the smart bulb. It ain't no Phillips. <laughs> Of course it ain't. Of course not be you no Phillips oil. So I don't know how long it's gonna last, but it's really is that it? Please let that be it. I think this is it. I don't think it's nothing. Oh too many pieces. Please don't let nothing be in this part. I don't think it is. Am I right or wrong? No, it's something. Yes, there's more. I didn't have to do it twice. I'm not excited about it at all. What? What is this? Cause I thought this was all black. Oh, this goes in the lampshade. Oh, okay, this is the lampshade. All right, y'all. Not thrilled for this. I hope it doesn't look that difficult though. Like. Not in the mood for this at all. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it looks really simple. Um, we gonna see. We have A. Are they all marked? Yep, this is A. Okay, cool. So this is the bottom. In which something, little pegs go Oh, well, duh, to put the, the middle rods. You know. All right. I'm not gonna use my drill because I'm telling you I can use this, but the drill probably will be faster. Do I actually know that for a fact? Okay, I guess it doesn't matter which way because they both. So. Okay, well, this is not going to be too bad, y'all. Still don't feel like doing it. Now I'm kind of sad that I did take that time crying <laughs> when I should have been working on this so that I wouldn't have to be up late with it. But this is fine. So, cause guess what? We about to make, see that? We about to make a whole little solo date out of this. I'm about to turn on some music and put this shelf together. I'm a sick man. I don't worry about hat and I'm still out of run. Yeah. Y'all gotta wanna they work 
to my nerves. I'm like the closest sir. I don't have nothing, so there's nothing to regret. Uh-huh. Oh, then this awful kick drum pounding in my head. When I bought Jess, they saw things, and I'm big fish. Eat caviar when I'm big pressed. All right, y'all, it took about an hour, but um, I have both of the lamps up. Y'all, that was a lot, like my back is hurting. The hardest part was the actual shade, like to be honest, putting the shade together. Um, I'm about to move in my room, but they did not give any instructions for this light bulb, like none. I know that it's Wi-Fi, y'all can see like the little blue check mark up there, I get that. But like, oh, is there not an app? Like the Philips one, like why would you not give instructions? All right, y'all, so here are the, the lamps. Y'all can see the shelves. I have not turned them on, but they're plugged up, so. <laughs> oh my gosh, are you serious? Why? <laughs> Nothing. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's my bad. Okay, y'all, let's try this again. And now it's blinking. <laughs> oh man, that's probably because okay. So now we gotta see because they didn't give us any instructions. Um, it's blinking, so I'm gonna open up my phone and go to my um uh, Bluetooth. Okay, y'all. So I lied. There was a little uh pamphlet like in the uh, box with the that the light bulb actually was in. So, um, I downloaded the app. It's like a damn cozy app. Oh my God, please. Please. Let me get in here first. Y'all, I did not sign up for this today. Okay. Anyway, we should be in discovery mode now. Searching for nearby devices. All right. I probably should have did both of them at the same time, but I don't know. Y'all see this light going on and all? Um, now it wants me to put in my Wi-Fi passwords. Mm -hmm. Alright y'all, it is adding. And it looks like it's going to take a little minute. I just want y'all to know. Okay, maybe not. It's still adding though, but it stopped blinking. Okay, whatever. I just want y'all to know that Phillips did not, Phillips did not put me through this. Let's see what kind of lighting we got. Let me put y'all over here. I guess it, this light, oh, it did it. Okay, cool. It didn't take that long. Cause I want y'all to see. Um, so I'm gonna turn it off from my phone. So this is just one light. I know we got two, but I want y'all to see just how dark it really is in my bedroom. All right, and then it has like a timer. Oh my God, it play music. How? Wait a minute. Y'all, it's blue now. The light turned blue when I hit music. Cozy life without the access to the microphone. Okay. I don't know. Oh, it's me talking. Okay, I don't know what that is. It anyway. Um, scene. Say good night. Read. Oh, just different lights. Okay, I'm messing with it. Here's the color, so y'all can see me adjusting the color, and you can adjust like if it's bright or not, um, or even like your white light. Oh, I guess not. Oh, yes, you can. Oh, cause see, oh my God, y'all see now it's like blue, and then it's like yellow. Anyway, so let's set up the next one. Okay, y'all, so now, oh my God, it's pretty bright. We have um, both lights set up. This is very much bright than how it was. Uh, but I don't think, cause that's, yeah, say smart lights too. I don't think I can control them both. I'm trying to see, where's the other one? Finish, okay. So, yeah, this is nothing like, okay, I got it. Um, so, yeah, they're not, I can't control them both at the same time, I don't think. Uh, so, yeah, no, because I just turned that one blue. Y'all can see it changed. I'm going to do...
I'm gonna turn my neon light on. Um, so I'm gonna do like a blue. See what it looks like. And then I have to do this one. So you have to do them separately. Which is fine. So now the lights are blue. Let's see what it looks like with the neon sign. First, I'm going to turn um, the lights off in here. Ah, oh my gosh. Yeah, this is cool. Y'all look at the ambiance now. Okay, I like this. Um, looking for the remote for my neon sign. Oh, it's under the pillow. <laughs> Y'all know it's on like the um, the 10 setting. Well, so I'm going to put it at 100% and it's seen. Because it's low. You can still just really see the blue lights. And that's what it higher. Oh my God. So we got blue and green going on. I just thought it was cute. Um, You know. Set the. Let me see if I dim these lights. Can y'all tell I dimmed the light? Yeah, it got darker. Mm. Y'all, is this breakfast? Is this breakfast? Well, it is two o'clock, but girl, girl. Oh! oh, remember our conversation we had yesterday about you know, healing not being linear. Like I said, today was a good day. It is 2 o'clock, like 2.22, so almost 2.30. But I did go to the gym. I met somebody new at the gym, and I started a conversation coming out of my little shell. Um, I made breakfast. Like I said, even though it was later in the day, I don't remember really eating before 4 o'clock in the past, like, three weeks. It's been three weeks, y'all. Tomorrow will be... No, it's been three weeks. It's th three weeks. Um, so I'm just excited to actually have eggs. I made my eggs in my hash brown thing that I do. Um, I have to show y'all this jumpsuit. That's the only reason why I'm here, because I'm finna edit. Oh, yes, it goes so good with these nails. So yeah, I wanna show y'all this jump jumpsuit that I'm gonna take pictures of in later. We should be good weather-wise. So I don't know if I showed y'all this before, like when I first got this sample. I know I posted it on Instagram, but I have these now. Um, it's basically like our last little hurrah. These were supposed to come out with the shorts. That's why they're shorts. But I didn't get them till like, what, like Monday? Anyway, I still think it's really cute. And if you live in the South, it's still gonna be hot. For at least the end of October so you can definitely wear it and you can put like oh y'all see my mama in it if you've seen a live but you can definitely wear like a cardigan or a jacket with it if it's a little you know a little chill but it ain't really gonna get cold here like that to like middle end of November um this is what the back looks like uh it is like a back out type of thing but I feel like it has really good coverage so that it doesn't go too far down and on the side like where your problem areas will be if y'all can see my little roll right there it is covered up um so it still has good coverage even though it's kind of a little backless and yeah i really like it well of course i do <laughs> i love it it's very comfortable i'm probably gonna wear it to work out tomorrow i might save it for leg day but this is the jumpsuit i hope y'all like it i hope y'all want it <laughs> um y'all know we don't do nothing but compression fabric here so very compressive the shorts don't really move too much i think that's because it's a one piece i really don't know because i feel like are they longer than the regular shorts they might be but i didn't really feel like they was but um they don't move as much as the shorts do and there is no seam in the front so yeah today is a good day i need to clean up but i have to work first and i'm starting pretty late so i'm gonna go ahead and edit this vlog i will see y'all definitely this weekend i'm going to dinner friday i'm pretty sure our pottery event is saturday but i don't know i have a massage a massage schedule for saturday with my favorite masseuse you can never get him i know y'all like damn all she do is have starbucks and go get massages yes yes self-care but thank y'all for kicking it with me we making our way Every day it get better. Some days it dip a little bit, but we always come back. So I hope that helps somebody like just really 
go back again what I said yesterday what my therapist said about um, when you start to feel down or whatever take grace and ask yourself what do I need to take care of myself right now in this minute and do that like and then when you can get back you can get back but anyway y'all I'm gonna go thanks for hanging out with me I'll holla